And uh, and even at the beginning of my career, I was into playing juju music, Fuji, you know. Yeah, I did. And I did that for a while. But then I listened, I think I, I saw a video of Judd Benson playing Brazil. And I was hooked. You know, that was the moment that changed everything for me. And uh, I said, I really want to do something like that, you know. And that was what inspired me to start playing jazz. It was actually Judd Benson. And it's where I'm stuck in the jazz and I, you know, knew other guitarists to just make up real, to pass, you know, because, you know, they're fully high, you're a very young person. Basically, uh, uh, journey into my life, you know, as a man, as a musician, and, uh, you know, the things are like, the kind of music I grew up with. All those things came together to inspire the album, the cover. <laughs> So this is Tony Sticks. He's doing uh, the Jane Bay, the Chicago, the Omele, and whatnot. Yeah. So let me tell you a little story about this guy right here. Like yeah. Gallery. Yeah. 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 Time coming um, since my first uh, my first single drop in 2012 as an artist, you know, we're up. People have been expecting me to drop an album, you know, it just dropped up. Like, so, ladies and gentlemen, this is my man TJ Benny Ebenezer, and uh, he's a producer, of course. Yeah, he's a producer, <laughs> obviously. Uh, but on this record, he's co producing with me, I am producing. <laughs> you know, I produced, yeah. <laughs> I produced this album, and he co-produced, and he was also the recording engineer. Recording engineer, mixing and mastering engineer. So he's, you know, he's, he's an amazing guy, he's an amazing musician, so, and uh, it's really a blessing, you know, working with him and everything. Because he's by far the only musician that I can really click with and understands my music, understands what I do, you know, my thinking, and we can both bring it to life, so. We have friends, we've been friends for, for ages now, let me put it that way. And I like his sound, I like his playing, I like his personality. So when it came to me that, okay, let's do this, I have this feeling that, okay, he's going to take us far. But the main thing is the choice of the sound, the way it is, the dexterity, the, the toner quality. And it's and, and, and it's unique. So that's why I do not. I, I, I don't have any choice. That's why. Right. <laughs> <laughs> we are friends. Our know? friends support each other. Definitely. <laughs> okay. Um, nine songs on the album. Uh, basically, it's a storyline. You know. Uh, let me just give you the track list of of my head. Is here our world. In no particular order, there's Raoro, there's Smile, there's Wewe, there's uh, Better Age, there's uh, Shishé, there's Ayo, there's uh, Ori Ife, there's Ori Ife. Uh, I think we have two more tracks in the album, like I cannot really remember right now. But then, uh, I think for, for every track, there's actually, you know, that story to it that embodies the title, the album. You know, only first shows, you know, the romantic side to family, it's an acoustic song, just the guitar, or the way they call it, naked guitar, just the guitar, no other instruments, and acoustic guitar, and it's very, very beautiful. 
movies. It shows my romantic stuff. Oh, now I remember. There's a song called Rain that featured uh, uh, an amazing poet, Titi uh, Lopesh and Luga. She's simply amazing. And the song is called Rain. You know, this was also an experience I went through. You know, see the irony from Ori Fe, the romantic guy, to Rain, the guy that is out in the and broken. Trying to find this place again and just step back. You know, it's your own road that gives glory to God. You know, it's a bright and morning star. Then you smile, you know, definitely self explanatory that you should smile regardless of whatever happens. There's where, 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 where is a story pitched uh, to me that was pitched to me by the LA. An amazing story, an amazing story. So I wrote this song about that. So I like, see, you know, it's built myself like that. And there's a uh, Ayo. Ayo means joy. So, uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a prayer. It says, Ayo, Koniko Nilewa, Ayo, Abawa Kalela means joy will never leave our house for you. Joy will be with us all the days of our lives. And uh, there is also Shishé, you know, that last track on the album. Shishé is, uh, is a wake up call, it's a, like an anthem. You know, you can't just sit down. You know, even the Bible says it is going to bless the work of your hands. If you are not doing anything, cannot bless anything, do you understand? So it's basically saying stand up, you know, get up, get you know, get your work on, whether you're a doctor, a lawyer, whatever it is that you do. You can't just lazy out. You can't just say there's no work to do. You know, once you get out there, you know, you start working, go with it. So that's what it's always about. Yeah. All those tracks, you know, they're embodiment of the album in camp, which makes work.